Hi again. I'm coming to you today with the definitive video on how to invest during a presidential election year, or for that matter, any election year. So let's go through some of the things that you should consider during this potentially volatile time. Now, you may want to write some of these things down because they are important to you as an investor. Number one, what's your timeline? When do you think you're going to be needing this money that you're investing? Two, what kind of risk are you willing to take on a day-by-day -day or year-by-year -year basis? For many people historically, they may have made more money in a volatile investment, but they got to deal with the ups and downs. So consider that. Three, don't put your eggs all in one basket. You may not want all the money in one category. Typically, it makes sense to diversify, and that controls your risk a little bit. So if one area is down, the other area is up. Four, what are the fees you're going to be paying for this investment? Are you getting any advice or service with it? And is it tied up or is it in a place where you can access the money if you need it? If you're thinking to yourself, well, this doesn't sound very different. This doesn't sounds kind of like pretty much any other time I invest. Well, guess what? Breaking news, that's exactly correct. Investing with your political leanings in mind tend not to be the smartest way to go. My recommendation is stick to your guns, be consistent, have a plan, have a strategy, follow it, review it. Work with someone that can help you, not just with your investment advice, but with all of the other things that go along with it. And don't let the white noise take you away from your plan. Have a great election season.